What's up, world? Platinum Gamer Plays here, and today is an historic day indeed. It is um, January the 28th. I am super excited for Pokemon Legends Arceus. So without further ado, let's begin. I'm probably just going to do the first half hour of gameplay or so, so hopefully you guys enjoy. Uh, yeah, this should be fun. Really looking forward to it. I know this is kind of odd, but I was getting really mad because people were getting the games like two weeks or two and a half weeks in advance and putting spoilers like all over the internet. So I was getting really pissed. Either way, I am very happy to have the game now and looking forward to it. So yeah, let's do this. Because we're talking to Arceus right now. My name would be Platinum G. When I'm naming myself in Pokemon games, the full name of my account never fits, so I always just go Platinum G. No, not Platinum T. No. No, with a G. I have to do the whole thing again. I apologize. There we go. Yes. Alright, let the journey begin. I don't know why I was tempted to start singing like the Pokemon Journeys uh, anime opening there. Are we floating? Are we swimming or what? Ah, we're falling. Oh no. That's not good. Oh, it's my phone. Get it. Get the phone. Get the phone! I lost my phone, guys. It doesn't exist anymore. Oh. What's happening? Oh no. Oh no. Am I gonna blow up? Oh. Is Arceus saving my phone? The god is saving my phone, guys. He's saving my phone! Thank you, god. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Oh. Oh, okay, thank you. Yay. I have a phone now. Hooray. Pokemon Legends Arceus. I am super excited, you guys. I like the loading screen in like the bottom right there. It's cool. Wake up! I feel like we're playing a Zelda game, you know. I can't even think of a game where Link doesn't start his adventure sleeping. Actually, no, I can. Majora's Mask, kind of, but he's sleeping in Ocarina of Time, and Majora's Mask is, like, directly after Ocarina of Time. And, like, the first Legend of Zelda game, like, The Adventure of Link. I don't think he's sleeping in that one. Anyway. Uh, who are you? I know where I am. This is the Hisuian region. Because, you know, I've seen the trailers. I already know that much. I don't know. Yes, I'm in a bit of a pickle. I don't know. I don't have anywhere to stay. I don't know anyone. I don't know where I am. I don't know who you are. Please help me. Somehow, I guess. Yeah, I'll just forage for berries and apricorns. Don't mind me. Oh, it's the Hisuian starters. Nice. Do I get to pick them here or later on? I don't know. Crew. Foom. Splish Splash. I know it's plish without the... Anyway. Of course I know what Pokemon are. I got like nine years of experience under my belt. What is this over here? 
How do you run? Oh. Does that say you crouch? So B is to crouch. Oh. Is that my phone? It's my phone! It's like the Arceus phone. Or Arc phone, technically, I guess. My step I stepped on my phone, guys. If they made a phone case like that, would you buy it? I would. That's actually really cool. I like that. Yeah, Arc Phone. Okay. So RCS Phone or Arc Phone for short. Cool. Okay, so this is how we move the camera. This is... Oh, that's how you save progress. Alright. Uh... Yeah. So these aren't, like, collectible items. How do you determine that? Because I know in Breath of the Wild they, like, shimmer just a little bit. But whatever. I used to just have to memorize what they look like and if you're able to collect them. We got Rowlet. You know what's funny? On the back of the box, it said basic uh, reading capabilities is necessary to fully enjoy this game. But then he just said a big word like photosynthesize. I don't think the seven year olds playing this are gonna know how to read that. Anyways, we got Cyntaquil and Oshawa. Cool. After seeing the Hisuian, uh, like, final evolutions, I'm gonna go with uh, Oshawa. I know originally I was going to pick Rowlet, but now I'm going with Oshawa, honestly. Oh, cool. Pokeballs. I got 50 Pokeballs. Nice. This game looks so beautiful. I mean, just, like, look at this. Look, I mean... How could you not like this? This is beautiful. Alright, so I guess I gotta go catch the professor's, professor's Pokemans now. Hello. Yeet. <laughs> nice. Alright, sweet. So I guess I gotta go catch the other two for him, too. Alright. I saw Oshawa up here. Why did I s no Rowlet? If I catch this, I know like I know you're able to sneak up on them from behind. This was like in the trailer. Nice. Now I feel like. They can't be, like, all first try. Like, you have to learn that you can't catch them all first try. Hello, Cyntaquil. Nice. Alright, do we catch it? Oh, it got away. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of thought so. Oh no, I show emotion. That's good. Glad they're finally, like, giving our, like, character emotion. It's like... Nice. Alright, cool, we got all the starters. For this region. So we have to give them back. Which kind of sucks, but that's okay. That's my phone. You like my phone? So it looks like Arceus chose us to be like the, the chosen warrior to come back and make the first Pokedex. So I'm guessing that we were in the future and we got like time traveled here. You've convinced me. I'd like to join the galaxy expedition, please. Thank you. Alright, sweet. Now we get to go to Jubilee Village. Yes. Finally, we're acknowledging this thing. I noticed that earlier too when we were talking to him, but I didn't think much of it. It kind of reminds me of like the uh, wormholes in uh, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. And the uh, uh, 
Sword and Shield uh, Crown Tundra expansion pass. I know it, they don't look like that at all, but that's just what it reminds me of. Anyway, uh, the sun is setting upon the Hisuian region. Everything seems so peaceful and calm. Alright, sweet. Now we're in Jubilee Village. Tree looked a little funky. Like the ones on the left there. Yeah, those ones on the left, yeah. They look kind of odd. I feel like they could have done a little better on that, but that's okay. Honestly, it's just trees. I don't care. This game looks absolutely beautiful, and I can't wait to spend hundreds of hours playing it. This way, if you please. Okay, how come I can't run right now? Oh well, that's fine. Where did you come from? I came from the sky! <laughs> Anyway, I wish I could run right now. What manner of dress is that? I'm a guy, I'm not wearing a dress. Yeah, shh, I can hear you, jerks. Not supposed to talk to strangers, you know. Who's that with the professor? Right, said something about a canteen, so I guess we gotta go get some food. Arc phone, show me where we go. Oh, okay, that's cool. So it's kind of like uh, a lot of like open world RPGs. There'll be like a little glowing mark you have to go to. Cool. So it's really like canteen. Yeah, so I guess I just gotta go get some food. I look suspicious, oh no. I have a sad face. You know what's suspicious? That mustache man. What is that? Bamboo? Celery? Please explain. Why is it green? I think it's dawn. No, I'm kidding. It, it looks very much like dawn. Just different clothing and facial expressions. Anyway, I think if I remember right, her name is Akira. I don't remember for sure though. Yeah, Akira. I remember. Yay, I remembered correctly. I wasn't watching the spoilers, guys, I swear. My friend told me. We literally got the same, like, the game on the same day. But he got it, like, a few hours before me, because he downloaded it, like, as soon as he woke up. But I had to get up and, you know, make breakfast, make do all my chores and all that fun stuff. So I got it around, like, 1.30 or so. Right now it's 4 o'clock. So, when I'm done this video, I actually have to go somewhere. But, yeah. I don't know. Probably just gonna do... Yeah, I am 15, how'd you know? Uh, yeah, first half hour of gameplay or so. I would do an hour, typically. But the way my computer works, it... It seems to take up a lot more storage than it did with my phone. Because, like, on my phone, an hour-long video would be, like, 3 gigabytes. But on my computer, it's, like... 48, which really sucks. And the USB stick I have only holds like 16 gigabytes of data. So I'm gonna have to keep this video somewhat short. Benny old chum, do you use a little potato mochi if you please? Sounds British. No. Anyway. I've actually had uh, mochi before. Not, not uh, potato mochi, but just mochi. <laughs> Look at her face, it's so... Ugh, seriously. Anyway. I'm not even reading the dialogue right now. When I do... Because this is like my gaming channel. Uh, but when I do uh, go on my channel... Or my... my uh, Just my me profile. I don't know. I, I will be reading them a little more thoroughly. Because, yeah. All of this is probably very important. <laughs> Aggressive click clacking of plates. Anyway. Quite delicious indeed. Yeah, I want to join the Survey Corp. How do you pronounce that? Silene? How do you pronounce that? Like his name, I mean?
Oh boy. What's happening? No, oh, nothing's happening. Okay. Alright, cool. So now I got my own quarters. It's a little futon. Kind of nice. I have my own house now. Like in previous games, you always lived with your mom. Now you're 15. You just go do whatever you want. Nice. This is actually a very nice place. If I ever get like an apartment or like a little house or a cabin somewhere, I want it to look like this. So we got some books here. Oh yeah, that's the up button. I did that earlier. Yeah, and then there's the autosave function. I'm sure I can turn it off. I didn't read that, but anyway. So this, and yeah, there we go. Save progress. Cool. Alright, let's get some good night's sleep. Yes, rest till tomorrow morning. Oh, something's happening. Oh. Oh. Oh, wait, I think I know what's happening, actually. Yeah, doesn't, like, lightning strike the tree? Yeah. Pretty sure that's the tree where we have to go face, uh, Cleaver. Or I think that's how it's pronounced. The evolved form of Scyther. And not Scizor. Can you still get Scizor in this game? I don't remember. Anyway. Yay, it's the next morning. Wait, hang on a second. <laughs> okay, hang on. I'll, I'll show you what I mean in just a sec. See, this box here, uh, it looks like the box that Nezuko is in. You know, like, but it's actually just a cabinet, like, from, you know, like Nezuko from Demon Slayer? That's just what it looked like. It's cool. Anyway. All right. Fresh new morning. I got my own futon. I'm in Jubilee Village. Akira coming to greet me. It's nice of her. I think, yeah, we're at like 17 minutes right now. Okay. Alright. I gotta go follow her, I guess. Nice, I like it in here. It's like a big mansion. The red and gold really goes together. It's nice. I like this. I like it very much. Hello, I am here. Let's get straight to it. All right, let us get straight to it. Okay, so he's giving me like some tasks to do to see if I'm worthy of joining. Nice, I got a fanny pack. Let's go. I guess it's a satchel, but it looks more like a fanny pack. Ignore me. Oh, sweet. This is where we get to pick our starters. Crew. Foom. Plish plash. Called it. I remembered. Or pish. I don't know. Whatever. Okay, sweet. Well, like I mentioned earlier, I am going to pick Oshwat. I explained why. But yeah, alright, Oshwat. Would you like to be my partner? Yes, hello, Oshwat. Be my partner. Oh, please. Oshwat seems much bigger in this game than previous games. Is so that just me? Yay. I'm so excited. Like, I'm like racing, my heart is pounding. I just, I'm so excited. This game has looked amazing.
Yeah, I got 20 Pokeballs. So let me think. He gave us 50, and then 20, and then minus 4. So we should have 66, right? 50 plus 20 is 70, then minus 4, right? Oh, we only have 20. Oh, I guess I gave the Pokeballs back to him afterwards. I wonder what happens if you use, like, all the Pokeballs, you know? Like, will he give you 50 more to use? I don't know. Alright. We have our headings. Hello. You look like an interesting character. I would love to have a Pokemon battle. I love that music, let's go. Like, just like, first three seconds, I'm bopping my head. It's got a Togepi, guys! Go, Oshawa! Alright, let's do this. Alright, so, it looks like I can't use, um, the Agile, or, like, what was it, Agile Style and, uh, Power Style or something? I guess I unlock that later on in the game. And I'm only realizing this now, but for a level 5 Pokemon, I have 70 HP. Which is insanely high. Like, I guess it it's just more in this game. You know, like, whatever. It's fine. And yeah, we still have more than half HP. This is good. Very good indeed. Nice, and he leveled up. And he got a new move. Nice. I'm guessing it's a water gun. I don't know. Nice, we got five potions, too. And they restore 60 this time, instead of, like, 20 or 30, like in previous games. I mean, it makes sense, because we have a lot more HP now. Sweet. Loving the game so far. To the Obsidian Fieldlands. Nice. Whenever I think Obsidian, I think Minecraft. I don't know why. I guess I do know why, but anyway. Alright, let's go. Okay, I want to go here. To the field camp lands or whatever. Nice. It's looking nice. Alright, so I just gotta catch three Pokemon. Well, you see. Looking, he looks kind of cross-eyed right now. Look, he's looking at his nose. Anyway. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna pass with flying colors. Stop being so, like, negative, Akiri. You think I'm just some random noob? Well, I'm more experienced than you. I got nine years of experience under my belt. I like this. This looks beautiful. Yeah, I want to stand where she's standing and look out. Yeah, look at my face. That's the same face I'm making right now. Aw. Oh, this is beautiful. I don't know why people are hating the game so much. This is beautiful. I love it. I would gladly buy this game again. And give it to my friend. So that way he could experience it. Because I, I don't have any use for two games. Two of the same games. Unless I broke one or something. Or wanted to keep it for like 20 years, and then sell it for a lot more money. Anyway. Alright, I got this. I almost called her Dawn. Okay. Right, you can't sprint. I mean, maybe you can, I don't know. Alright. The Bidoof. Yeet. That was way too high. Anyway. I get him. Nice, I got him. Yay, I caught a Bidoof. Oh, there's like a... 
the medicine leak or whatever they were called over there. I forget. I know you need them for making potions. I don't know when we get the recipe for it, but whatever. Oh, it's a starly. Let's catch that starly. Now, if I remember, remember blah, blah, blah. if I remember right from the trailer, they're like skittish Pokemon. So if they notice you, they'll likely fly away or at least try to get away. So we're gonna do this. I'm gonna crouch. You can't see me. I'm not here. Oh wait, I want to try something. Uh, there. See the berry. Yeah, so now he's, like, less likely to notice me, and just, like, bam, just like that. All right, let's go. Yay. Yay! Now we just have to catch a Shinx. Okay. Well, these are one of those trees. It looks like Oron berries or some kind of blue apricorn. So, if I remember right, you need a Pokemon, and you just throw it at the tree, and then they'll get the items for you, which is very nice. I know in the trailer we saw Rowlet doing it, and Snorlax, so I'm assuming it means you can use any Pokemon. So let's just swap here, and then throw Oshawott at the tree. Boom, just like that, we got some Oron Berries, nice. Okay, now, if my memory serves me correctly... Shinx is like an aggressive Pokemon, so if it notices you, you can't throw a Pokeball at it to catch it. You have to battle it in order to catch it. So I'm going to try to sneak up behind it, but that might not work. So yeah, we'll have to battle it, I think. Alright, cool. I'm loving this game so far. This is beautiful. I paid like... 90 bucks for this? Oh, he noticed me right away. Well, that's no fun. I'm just curious. If I stand, like, right here, will I get damaged? Use Aqua Jet. Oh, I do. Okay, I'll be sure not to stand there. It was a critical hit, too. Uh, mm, tackle, hopefully that doesn't knock it out. Oh, it did. I wanted to catch it, no! I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, there's another one right there. Oh, he noticed me right away. Alright, let's go. Alright. Fight! Use Aqua Jet! Bam. Yeah, so last time it was a critical hit. Now if I use Tackle this time, it should be okay. Yes! Let's go! Okay. I have uh, Shinx, well, I guess technically a Luxury, uh, on my team in uh, BDSP. Well, I, I have, <laughs> I bought both Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, but I haven't even opened Shining Pearl yet. It's literally sitting on my shelf and it's still sealed. Yay, I caught the Shinx. Happy day. This is wonderful. I did indeed pass with flying colors. Let's go. I ah, look at that old camera. I love it. Hey, hey, look at me. I'm smiling. So beautiful. Anyway. Yeah, so I'm looking at my laptop right now, and we're sitting at about half an hour, uh, almost. And this is like a loading screen right here, so this looks like a pretty good time to uh, save and maybe end the video, unless something else is happening important. Okay, cool. Yeah, so this is like a pretty good spot to uh, end the video. Uh, but yeah, sweet. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, uh, be sure to like, subscribe, and turn on that notification bell for more Legends RCS content. Alright, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.